receptionist uh, slash court usher for the commissioners. When required, I uh, bring the judge into the courtroom and I look after the judge and uh, you know whatever he, he, he requires, I look after him. And right after school, actually, I wanted to go into regular force and I was sort of turned away because back then the females weren't really required to go in or they didn't want them in the military. So then I joined the, uh, I, I took administration course and then I became a civilian working for national defense uh, for seven years. And in, in there, I met these people and I decided to, they asked, talked about the reserves. And so I joined the reserves at the same time. So I did part-time reserve while I was a civilian for D&D. And then uh, about seven years after that, I decided to go with regular force. And so I've done 32 years total with the reserves and regular force. Uh, the attraction was mostly the uniform. I wanted to be in uniform. <laughs> and that's why I went into the commissioners because I knew they had a uniform. And I knew the commissioners pr prior to when I got out. So it was just another nice tra transition from uniform to another uniform. My first aid, I was an administration clerk. Uh, and then they became a RMS clerk. And then uh, and that's what I was the whole career is my RMS and I'm in. The work ethics and the dedication has also brought over to the commissioners because they're a very prideful organization and very ethical organization. And I think that's very important that uh, from the military to the commissioners, it, it coincide, coincide each other.